There's na po si to reconstruction job hazard analysis. First, we have to identify potential known hazards before the construction proper. Job conditions, we have the whole roads and the access points. Considering also the lay down or storage areas. Office, tool, storage, and change trailers. The methods of construction must be clear if it increases risk or not. So we have to determine about this. Also consider unwanted side effects of the job schedule. For the hazard prevention and controls, take consideration of the following. The perimeter fencing and closures and signs, spotters provided for in the blind, backing, machines and or equipment. We're planning process workers to commit unsafe acts. Office trailers, change trailers, all roads, parking areas. Be alert, stay clear, and hear warnings. Temporary barricades and hazards are must be considered also. For the proper equipment maintenance, we have to Take consideration about the following. The machine in proper working order. The backup alarm for lights and mirrors. Cub glass not cracked or broken. Make sure of this. Machine windows, mirrors kept clean. Pre-operational inspection conducted by operator. Prompt repair of any noted deficiencies. And for the workers' awareness training. Does your job require you to approach moving or, or backing machines? Another one, how does the operator know where you are? Make sure you know how to answer all of this. Do you understand all signs, markers, and flags? Know what they mean? All workers must be aware of all the signs, markers, and plugs. They must be knowledgeable about this. You must always be alert to changing job conditions and your particular situation. Equipment operator responsibilities. First, we have the general guidelines, safety features on equipment, know how they operate and use them properly. Make sure of this with your equipment operator and make sure that they know their responsibilities. Systematic maintenance and repair, trained operators, trained repair personnel, pre-operational inspection of equipment, review manufacturers operating manual. Be specific. The most dangerous movement is actually backing. Know where your blind spots are. Look for people on feet around you. Stop when signated, when wave but violently, or when in doubt. Maintain a safe operating speed. Keep machine under control at all times. Take machine out of service if it is unsafe to operate. Make sure you are familiar with the operating characteristics of your machine. Be on the lookout for other trades working in the same area. Beware of other machines operating in the area. Frequently check for the location of other machines. Keep lights and backup alarm in operating condition. And reason, clear windows and adjust mirrors. Always inform appropriate personal or any abnormal conditions, defects or changes made in machine and or job procedure or conditions. Report unsafe workers to supervisor. Talk up safety with those who work with you. Maintain constant awareness. Do not attempt repairs or maintenance that you do not understand. Always check the mirror on the blind side. 
making sure of your clearance backing on the blind side should be avoided if at all possible. Learn and follow safe work practices. Have a signal man present when moving in or out of a building or structure. Stop machine frequently at night. Walk around and inspect machine. Stay alert. Clear or obstacles from the path of the machine. Beware of hazards such as wires, ditches, and etc. Thank you very much and God bless us all.